Hello, Facebook. So I just wanted to jump on really quick. Yep, my oven is ready, and I am just going to get my meatloaf um, into my pan. So um, I like to, you know, use stovetop stuffing as a base for my meatloaf. And then I typically um, top it with a barbecue sauce. So um, if you um, look later, I'm going to post the recipe. So it's um, two pounds of ground beef with two eggs, a cup of water, and then I have one package. And this is the savory herbs um, stovetop stuffing. Hey, yes, Rick. Here's meatloaf. This is the easiest and it tastes really good. Um, sometimes I throw in some A1, just a, you know, like tablespoon or teaspoon. If you don't like it, you don't need to put it in, but you know, you're gonna have to mix this basically with your hands. And the best thing <clears throat> is you wanna make sure you get all of the water is good and absorbed into the dressing. So I just kind of let it sit there for just a few seconds and now I'm starting to mix it together. Okay, and I've already greased my pan. So now I'm just going to put it in and then it's gonna go in the oven for an hour. Meatloaf, yum. I just try to push it all down in the edges and then I'm gonna to top it, like I said, with my um, <clears throat> barbecue sauce. You can use ketchup. You can top it with, you know, whatever you want. It's usually a couple of teaspoons or tablespoons enough to cover the top um, that's typically how I can I usually do it you can see that my meatloaf is ready to go in so thanks for watching and I will jump back um, it's going to go in 350 um, for about an hour